What's up, guys? I have a Walgreens haul for you today. Um, please like, share, comment, and subscribe before I begin my video. Um, so that way um, you'll know what's going on. And then hit the notifications bell below so that way you can be notified of future uploads. Um, I got a, a few pretty good deals that I want to share with you guys. Um, Here we go. So what I did was on the first transaction at Walgreens, I got the I did this on Monday. Yeah, and the time was I guess because it was a holiday, it was kind of like really like quiet and stuff. And I drove up to one Walgreens and I was like, some look shady right here, so I went to another one. <laughs> um not thinking that everybody probably at home, you know, doing their cooking out and enjoying family and stuff for the Memorial holiday. But, oh well. I went across town and did my little haul. So what I did was on the first um, transaction, I got the, um, I had coupons for the Chic um, razors. I got the Quattro um, razors. And I got, let me see how many I got of these. I got, um, I got the Quattro U and then I got the Quattro Raspberry Rain. So I guess it's supposed to have a certain scent to it. Um, I got, I guess I got five of those to, to do that deal. Um, to get the five dollar rewards back, let me let me check the paper. But anyway, these are the ones that I got. Let me turn them around so that way you can see. Because these are purple, the Quattro U are purple, and then the Quattro Raspberry um, Rain for women is um, the pink one. So this is. Hopefully, this will be my um, thumbnail if it stays up long enough. Yeah, I know I'm still recording on my tablet. I mean, not my tablet, but my laptop. So, hopefully, if this stays up long enough, it can be my thumbnail. Okay, like I said, I got five packs of those. So... And then I also got these. I started eating. These are the Juicy Center Fruity Melodies. This is the ones that I really like. Um, I got these in a big box from Walmart. But these are the ones that they have at um, Walgreens. So. No, they don't have a Fruity, a fruity Center. I wish they did, but... I like fruit bites anyway, so. And these were the $1.99. Um, you pay $1.99 and get $1.99 back, so. I did that deal a couple of times. And I'm about to eat this. This is, I love that juicy center. And it they taste just like fruit, so. Mm. Okay, so this is the deal when you buy the Black Forest candy. You get a $1.99 reward back, but you have to buy one. Each purchase that you make, you have to buy one to get that $1.99 back. Um, because you're not going to, if you buy more than one, you're not going to get that $1.99 reward for each of those. So just do separate transactions for that. And then... For the razors, I did this deal here. When you spend 20, you get a five dollar reward, and they were two for seven. So I ended up getting five packs of those razors to get that five dollar reward. And I had coupons, I had um, 
one seven dollar off um, coupon. And then I had another um, three dollar off coupon. Seven dollars, I think, was off too. And then I had a manufacturer's ECPN coupon, whatever that is. Um, so for seven dollars. So what I did was I ended up paying um, for this. I ended up paying only it was fourteen dollars and ninety nine cents, but the tax was two dollars and ten cents and six cents. So that made that seventeen dollars and fifteen cents. But I got my I got my five dollar reward for that, and then I also got the one dollar one dollar ninety nine cents um reward to go toward my next purchase, and I got that for the candy. Okay, and I ended up with um, 62,010 points with that. Let me show you what I paid. So that's 17.15. And I also saved 71% on those razors and that candy. And that's 30, I saved $35.95. And I know that sounds crazy because you're they're only razors, but you know, in these stores, that stuff is pretty high. So, so yeah, I did go ahead and do that. And let me go to my next transaction. Okay, I got the gummy bears on this one. And then I got the $1.99 back. back. I paid $1.99 plus tax, which equal to um, $2.05. I got $1.99 back. So um, my total savings was $1.50. I saved 43%. And on this transaction, I ended up with 62,020 points. I'm, I'm into this organic candy. Some of the their candies I don't like. Like I got the salted caramel or something. And I didn't like it. So, yeah, I ended up giving that away. And I have some more to give away because I, I wasn't thrilled with it. And that was... I saved 43% and let me show you my receipt for that. 43%. Okay. Well, then I got 199 back. So I only paid a few cents for it because you know you had to pay taxes. So okay, and then I got we already did I already show you? Okay, on this one, I got the gummy worms, same thing, save 43%, so that's the same as that receipt looks. So, so I ended up with um, 199 199 uh, well, pretty much like almost $4.00. To go towards my next purchase. Give me just a second to. $3.98. So that went towards my next purchase, which I am going to show you right here. This is my biggest purchase. Okay, I got the um, the Pyrex crystals. I love these things to put in my laundry. Um, the top is coming off of that one. Okay, I had the I got the fabulously fresh, and this is eighteen ounces. Now, when I did the deal, 
for these things at CVS. Those things were much smaller than this. So I love this size. And when you're getting a deal on this size, it makes it better. I got the Lavender Blossom. And I got the Fresh Spring Waters. I got two of those. And hopefully when I go back, I want to go back and get some more because I love my like stacking up on them. Um, I stacked up on them a while back, but then I eventually ran out. And then I had to go buy them regular price. So with this one, I just, I got the, I got to use my points to get those. So. And it was also actually buy one, get one free. Do you guys see that? Because I like to show you what I'm talking about. Sometimes I forget to bring my cell paper in. And I hate that I don't have a, a camera to record on because this laptop is kind of shows y'all what where what's you know area you need to be in to show stuff. But anyway, these are buy one get one free for the 18 ounce. <clears throat> and the regular price of them are $5.49. Um, I think at Family Dollar they may be they're probably around five dollars, so you know it's not much of a difference for that. So, I mean, when you divide two into, let me see. Five forty nine divide two equals like two seventy five a piece. Two seventy five a piece. That's not bad. So I'm gonna go back and get some more. It's a little late now. I don't want to go now, but. I kind of do. I think they close at 10 to go ahead and get some more and use my points, of course. Um, and then I got the, um, my son loves that Axe deodorant. So I went ahead and got him some more of that because the, the I just got him some in my last haul, but I wanted to get him some more because he'll wait until he's completely out. And say he needs some, and then we're about to go somewhere he don't have any deodorant. So I said I got to kind of like stack up on his deodorant so that way, you know, we don't have that problem because that that irks my nerves. I don't like giving out of stuff like that. Um, I guess y'all say that's all the time though, but I still, I went back and got him the gold original anti-marks, um, anti-perspirant for 48 hour. He loves the, the one in the white, um, container. So, um, and it says no white streaks, no yellow stains, but he does say he have some of those, some of that sometimes. Anyway, he loves the deodorant, so. As long as he's not walking around here funky, he good. I shouldn't have said that, should I? Oh, well. Um, and those are buy one, get one free. I love the way that Walgreens has their stuff, buy one, get one free. So when they're having a deal or a sale or whatever, and you, buy, you can buy one and get one free, that makes it a sale all the more better um, to me. I love it. Oh, and guys, guess what? I got the same lady at that Walgreens. Probably want to have that. Well, just don't never know with these people at Walgreens. But um, I got the same cashier that um gave me a hassle about my son doing a deal for me and taking the stuff to the car, coming back in. Um, she gave she um. Trying to see her name is not on here, it's just her number. 
uh, I forgot what she said her name was. Anyhow, she was there and she was nice to us at first. And then I was asking her, you know, because I know how she treated us before. I asked her, I said, are y'all okay with um, people couponing at your store? I didn't have my glasses on. So a lot of times reading the coupons, I can't see it. So I have to have him that to read it. And sometimes I don't do that because we're trying to rush. So I had a few things that um, didn't match the coupon. So, um, and then she um, tried to get a little sarcastic with me with, um, oh, this doesn't go with that, honey. And I was like, it's okay. I'm using my points anyway, darling. <laughs> um, you don't, I didn't say that. I ain't call it darling, but I'm just saying you don't have to be trying to scold me about these coupons because it's not like I'm trying to get over. I'm still fresh in the game. <laughs> um, but I think she thought I was trying to do something shady or, I, or, I, or she was just trying to be funny because she asked me, when I asked her um, the question about, do y'all have a problem with the couponers that come in here? And she was like, no. I was like, um, I just asked because um, I know some cashiers don't like it you know and we have a problem well I haven't gave you a problem have I? I was like well yes you have one time when we came in here and he was doing deals for me and you you did kind of give us a problem and after that her attitude changed I guess she didn't think I was gonna say um yes but yes she had she did give us a problem and then she started like talking you know how people when you're having a conversation with people and it's supposed to be personal and I hate this when you go to a, doc, a doctor's office, too. When, when it's supposed to be between you and that person, and it's kind of personal, and they are talking loud for everybody in the room or the store to hear, I don't like that because I'm a very private person. But anyway, she was like, um, this isn't the right um, coupon. This coup you can, We can't take this for that. And she was like, um, her voice was, you know, some people just talk loud. Either way, but I just feel like when we was talking to her in the beginning, she wasn't talking that loud. But then when this black guy came and got in the line behind us, she was like, I guess, in a sense, trying to embarrass me. And then um, when we were checking out, what she did was um, she was saying, OK, the, this coup, this receipt spit out like the transaction was finished because I swiped my card and everything. And she was like, well, you just swiped your card, didn't you? Um what I think she did was she put cash, she clicked on cash like I was paying her cash, um, but I was paying her with the car, and then she gave me a problem about that. But my car number, wait a minute, yeah. My car number was, it looks like it's at the bottom. Well, I think that's it. My Yeah. Anyway, it it look it's, it says cash on the receipt. Let me show you. It says cash because all I paid for all of this stuff um, was a dollar and eighty eight cents. I got a lot of more stuff to show you, but um, I paid a dollar and eighty eight cents, and the rest of it I paid with with my points. But anyway. I just didn't like that because I'm like, you know, if we're going to build a, a friendship, a relationship, because I told you, I said, I'm, I'm a coupon. I'm going to be coming here couponing. So um, just remember my face. Remember his face because we coupon and he coupons with me, you know, so that way she will she won't give us that problem. But when I let her, you know, know that you were the one that gave us a problem before. I don't think she liked that. And I wasn't being mean to her. I was just saying. Well, yeah, kind of, you know, before when we was couponing, you know, I said it nicely and everything, but um, maybe I shouldn't have said nothing because I didn't, I wasn't trying to offend her or, or anything, but in the end, it, it felt like that's what she was trying to do to me um, with this. And then she gave me a hassle about swiping my card again um, after I had already swiped. And I was like, well, I said, I'm not swiping my card again for this dollar and 88 cent. I said, we'll count out some. I asked my son, I said, if you got some change or got $2 so I could pay her, 
um, we'll do that. But I'm not swiping my card again for it, you know, because I already swiped it and the, and the receipt just spit out. So how did it not take? Because I, from, from me being a cashier before several times, until the transaction is finished, the receipt normally does not come out. So that was just really funny to me. And even though it says cash, I did swipe my card. So it had to be something on her, her end that she punched in. Um, even though it came up on my side for me to swipe, it was just really shady the way it happened. I don't know, really questionable. Um, but she don't have to be, you know, shady with us. We're not going to, just because of that day. Now, that day I was a little ticked and I wasn't, even after she apologized, I was still not, you know, like welcoming to her, you know. I wasn't mean to her, but I was like kind of standoffish, like you stay over there because I don't like the way you handled us with a store full of people trying to act like my son is doing something shady. When all he was doing was checking out, taking what I purchased to the car, coming back in so we could purchase some more stuff. If they're used to couponers, like she said they are, they should be used to people doing stuff like that. But some people just have to try to embarrass you and make you look like something that you're not. I'm not no criminal, honey. Anyhow, I got these nice plates because you paper plates because um who was that? I heard I think Nicole Burgess said they're just as tough as the um, Dixie plates in her video. I think that's that was Nicole um, or Savvy Couponer. I forgot. But anyway, it's only 20 in here. Um, so I will, I'm going to test these out and see if see if I'm going to continue to buy them because I love the Dixie plates. They they are tough. They hold up anything. So I might go back and get the smaller plates because there are more in there. Um, I probably will go back and get that and then some bowls. Also, because um, I like having heavy duty, and it says extra heavy durable on here. So I'm going to see. <laughs> and let me see. And make sure if you go and get those, you make sure you get them to scan back to find here so that way you can... Um, you can um, get them to three, two for three fifty. So it's, I guess that'll be what one seventy five a piece. Let me see. <clears throat> I could add a little bit in my head, but I'm trying to. Okay. Yeah, one seventy five a piece. Okay, and what else did I get? I got the angel salt. Um. That's not my favorite tissue, but the coupons that I had, the coupons that I had, um, I could not use because they were not the tw 12 row. And I didn't realize that when I picked them up. Um, I just, like I said, if I don't have my glasses on, because my with me having Shogun syndrome, some days it seems like I see pretty good, but some days it feels like a film over my eyes and I can't see clearly like the colors and it's just everything like blotchy and stuff but I could tell it was a angel soft coupon I just didn't read couldn't read the fine print anyhow I got two of these for three yeah 349 which is not bad for nine rolls it's not bad I just wasn't able to use my coupons so I'll be able to use them somewhere else And let me see. Y'all just bear with me. I'm a little behind on this stuff. Let's see, where is it at? Okay, I just had it. Okay, and yeah. They don't ever have these coupons for me to use my coupon either um, to get the 
the big roll. So the one, the coupon that I tried to use, um, it would not take it. And I didn't realize it because this to me, I had, had I not, I didn't have my glasses on. So this to me looked like three rolls in there. And that's what I was looking at. I wasn't looking at the, the small print up there of what it's saying. Anyway, I was trying to use that on, on that too. Not trying to do it shadily. Um, I'm just going to have to go ahead and break down and wear these glasses more often. Okay, so that's what that was. For each of those. Not a fan of that tissue. My favorite tissue is Charmin. That's my favorite tissue and the Quilted Northern. That's my favorite, but it's a little bit more expensive. Um, I got to check to see if I have some Quilted Northern coupons so I could get get those. Um, hopefully they'll have it because a lot of stuff that they have in the paper that they say we can get for a certain deal or price, they don't have it in the store. So that's another disappointing thing. Okay, and then I got these. Y'all know I told y'all I love these Great Sense air fresheners. A dollar a piece. They're not overpowering. So, um, an aerosol, you know how that stuff just takes your breath sometimes. This right here. Ooh. Smells so good. And it's not overpowering. I love, because I have um, allergies. And then, like I said, I have that Chauvin syndrome and I'm already like a, a dry and stuff. Like my mouth is dry now with all this talking. Oh, I didn't tell y'all what kind it was. I have the bright berries. Can you see that? Um, it's hard. Bright berries. Five and one. Then I have the tropical vacation. Five and one. Okay. Okay, and then I got something that me and my son just love to drink now. We, um, we started drinking the Mott's apple juice. We used to get the, um, I forgot what brand that was. Um, anyway, we love the Mott's apple juice. I had coupons for that also. And then, um, like I said, if I don't have my glasses on, I, don't, I can't see what the coupon says clearly. And the one I had was for two. Um, so I had one and I ended up handing her two of my coupons instead of one of them because I decided not to get four of these. I just decided to get two. Anyhow, this old lady going to say, well, you can't use this one. Like, And looked at me like, can she not read? I can read. I just am not able to if I don't have my glasses. Anyhow, let me show you the coupons that I have. I still have it on the side. I like to try to have that stuff kind of planned out. Like, I can see it clearly now. I can see it clearly now because I have on my reading glasses. These are not doctors prescribed. These are the Dollar Tree glasses, but they help me see better. And this is the one I had. I, only, I was going to get four of them. I'm probably, like I said, I'm going to go back and get some more of those paper plates. And I'm probably going to use this... Um, at the dollar, I mean, the, not the Dollar Tree, but the um, store down the street. But yeah, it's, you know, it's just little simple mistakes that coupons make if they kind of fresh in the game. And, you know, they kind of treat you like um, non factor. Mm. Y'all, I get those. Um, these are organ organic fruit chews. So, in my mind, I'm eating healthier. It's not chocolate. 
coração. Juice and it tastes just like some good sweet fruit. Not too sweet, but it's just right. Okay. What was I doing? Yeah, I don't know what I did with the sales paper. Wow, that was quick. Okay, there it is. It fell on the floor. Okay, so the um the apple juice was pay me on mine. I'm just a little I went to the gym today and I feel good because I had been feeling bad. The shogun's it sneaks up on you. I mean you can have a, a few good days and then it'll sneak up on you and then you're down and out. And it's disappointing, it's stressful. So today, um, I felt better. And I thank God for it because, oh, that's not in here. That's in the, the apple juice. It's not in here. It's in the Rite Aid paper for two for five dollars. But it's at Walgreens for two for five dollars. So that's what I paid for that. The max. Apple juice. Can y'all see that? I have to get me a camera for my YouTube and videos. And you see the um, powerhouse and the great sense um, air fresheners. One of them is powerhouse, one of them is great sense. Um, I kind of think they're the same company, the air freshener, but I love the great sense. Um, and the powerhouse is not overpairing overpowering either so um i do want to stack up on that because i like having that and i hope they'll never discontinue it because the other stuff like glade and renews it it can be overpowered for me and i like um a light sense okay and then i got a moon pie snack cake banana You know, the, the little mini moon pies. These are so good. They're good. It says made with real sugar. Ooh, 35 milligrams of sodium. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. 10 grams of added sugar. So, yeah, I can't eat these a lot. It's too much going on. And they are a dollar. And then I got these sparkle um, paper towels. I told you they didn't have the one that's in the, the cell paper here. They never have that. Why I look for it. They never have this, this uh, these sizes. They never have the um, eights. Um, let me see. Yeah. The eight um, mega rolls, I guess that that's what you would call it. They never have those. When I look for them, I always see the three jumbo packs. So it, it makes it hard for you to get the ones that you want to get with the coupons. Unless it says on any. So I got these. And this is my favorite paper towel. I have used um, the Scott paper towels, but this is my favorite. This is my favorite. Scott paper towels are my favorite. They're inexpensive and just depending on where you get them from, though. Like, I probably, if I wish Family Dollar would take um, coupons from coupons.com, but they don't. So. Oh, yeah. God, I'm, finna. I'm about to pull something down. Yeah. 
Okay, so all of this stuff that I got, um, I had three of the one ninety nine coupons from that Black Forest candy. So let me. <clears throat> Excuse me, my mouth is dry. So that was five dollars and ninety seven cents that I had to to come off of that. And also, I had a dollar off for the um, Mott's apple juice for buying two of those. And um, then I had the $2.50 off the ultra nice, the nice ultra plates. Okay. And this ended up being um, subtotal $34.24, which is not bad, you know. And then um, it ended up being $36.88. I redeemed $35 in points. My total remaining was $1.88, which is here. So y'all can see I paid $1.88. And then, just so happened, this very, very nice black man, man that I guess she was trying to impress when I was in the line checking out, um, he paid for it. And um, my son had, I think, like 85 cents of it. And he gave um, him that change. And the man just, like, lended us, like, a dollar and 20-something cents to finish this dollar and 88 cents off because I was like, I'm not going to keep swiping my card because I don't know what you got going on with your register and how you, you know, because I'm not going to be paying for this two times when I already paid for it. But anyway, the man was like, I guess he was ready to go. He didn't want to be standing in line with me trying to figure out what she did and why she did it. But anyway, um, my savings, my total savings on this was $24.88. Um, and then it was a total savings um, value of 42%. So, <clears throat> yeah. And I have what? Cold water, though. The next one. I got $45.70 towards my, um, to go towards my, um, next 5,000, um, beauty and personal care, which it probably won't take me long to get that because I always like to get my body washes and stuff and soaps and stuff and, you know, house stuff. So I ended up, Using thirty thousand points um, on this transaction, and they, it, I ended up with thirty-seven thousand um, ninety points. I still have some points left, so I'm gonna try to build those points back up so that way I can, you know, do my house. But these people don't realize because um, she was like, she did ask me. She was like, "You need to teach me how to coupon, lady." I'm still learning, but if you're gonna be giving People problems. Ain't nobody gonna want to teach you nothing, you know. But um, I could, you know, if it, if it's something that she want to know, I'll tell her. You know, I just don't like the way she's trying to play a little stark, sarc sarcasm with us. But um, like we don't know stuff. Like what I have to do, like my son said, is mama. Every time you get in the car, <laughs> put your glasses on, cause I keep my reading. I mean, my um eyeglasses in the car so that way when I go somewhere I would have them with me because if I don't keep them in the car I won't have them with me <laughs> so I'm just gonna have to remember and I keep glasses here at home so that way when I have to read here um I can see better well you guys I'm not gonna hold you up um What I'm going to leave you with tonight is just say, pray it up, pray for our youth, especially um, 
the ones that are being targeted. Just pray for our youth. Um, yeah, and God loves you, and I do too, and there's nothing you can do about it. Peace out. Bye.